Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time I'm talking about every female Marvel Legend from 2020. So the first female we got was in the Super Scroll Builder for your wave. We got Sue Storm, the Invisible Woman. And their darker blue costumes, newer uh, Fantastic Four look there with the Invisible Shield and with the torso. Also, in that same way, we got the She Hulk figure, a gray form with the green slashes all over. I love this form. This is probably one of my favorite figures of the year. She came with both right arms for the Super Scroll Build figure, with an extra hand sculpture for herself. Next, as a Walgreens exclusive, announced at the German Comic-Con Dortmund last year, we had the Step for Cuckoos. Of course, Army built the sucker so that you could get all three or even uh, build all five. Uh, count the two that had died as well. If you wanted to use all the blonde heads to, to make them if you wanted to. And the extra hand sculpts, some little effects on their arms, and also the Cerebro helmet. Next, from the Riders' Wave, we had the Squirrel Girl with her Vespa and her Squirrels. Another wave we had was the Demo, or Demi Goblin Build-A-Figure Wave. And in this wave, we had the White Rabbit figure, and also one of my favorites of the year. She came with the Flight Stand and the Glider. Also came with an umbrella for herself. Next wave we had was the Strong Guy Build a Figure Wave, Deadpool Wave. And in this wave, Sheikla. And she came with Jeff the Baby Shark and the Strong Guy Arm. The next wave we had was the Joe Fix It Build a Figure Wave from the Gamerverse. And in this way, we had the Jocasta figure. She comes with the torso. So from the Black Widow wave, that of course we still have not seen the movie yet, we have the Crimson Dynamo build a figure wave. And in that way, we have the Scarlett Johansson Black Widow. Comes with the right leg, a couple guns, a couple clubs, a couple hands. We also have the Yelena Belova, her White Widow costume. Comes with the torso and a couple extra hands, a couple guns. And then as a fan channel exclusive, we had the Deluxe Black Widow, uh, Scarlett Johansson again, in her White Widow costume with this Deluxe stand. The explosive effects, all the hands, the guns, the hooks, all that good stuff. There's a nice look at those explosive effects. A lot of people got this just for the figure stand. There's the back of the box and a closer picture of Scarlet herself. Next, she had a Walgreens exclusive Black Widow in her gray outfit. Has her brown jacket on and her jetpack. Got all kinds of great effects with this one as well. And then as a Target exclusive, you had the Black Widow in her white costume from Deadly Origin. Nice sniper rifle, a couple guns with the silencer on it. A lot of effects come with it as well. And then as a UK release this year, we did get re-released of the Thanos Armor Build a Figure Wave. And in that Thanos Armor Build a Figure Wave, they did give us another Black Widow figure. And they also gave us a rescue figure. So here is Rescue. And this is of course a re-release of previous Rescue. And here is that Scarlett Johansson Black Widow. Got the two clubs, and her hair this time is red. Next wave we have was the Sugar Man Build a Figure Wave for AOA. And in this wave, we did get a Jean Grey figure. Comes with the face and back. 
for the Sugar Man Battle figure. From the X-Men box Marvel Legends, we did get a Mystique figure for Rebecca Romain Stamos. Comes with that extra arm, looks human. There it is with the arm on. Would have been nice to see her face uh, have a human look to it as well, maybe. And there's the back of the package. Nice artwork on these X-Men figures this year. Here is the Domino figure from the Deadpool movie. And it's very interesting the way they did these Fox De Deadpool figures with the marking out and rewriting in by Deadpool. So she has two different head sculpts, two different guns, three different guns, I guess, and uh, a couple different hands. There's the back of her package as well. Nice artwork. And then we have the two pack with Ryan Reynolds Deadpool and Negasonic Teenage Warhead. There is Negasonic Teenage Warhead from that two pack. There's the back of that package. Nice artwork again. SDCC this year gave us the Hellfire Club, which also gave us the Emma and as the White Queen and the Jean as the Black Queen. Also gave us uh, the Celine head. There's the front of that package. Back of that package. Inside of the package panels. Inside of the box, a little blurry. And their photo it comes in the box as well. Next, uh, also announced at the German Con was the vintage black costume storm. Also, we got another black costume storm, which was a Target exclusive. And it came as a two pack with Thunderbird. She has two different head sculpts, two different capes. One calm, one like it's blowing in the wind. She has the lightning effects coming out of her hands. There's the back of that package as well. Also, we have another two pack for this X Men stuff with the Rogue Pyro two pack. Two different head sculpts on that one as well. There's the back of that package. Loving this artwork. Next, we got another rogue in the vintage. Everybody had sought after that rogue from the Juggernaut wave, so they decided to give us a blue paint with a brighter yellow color and a different head sculpt. Also, the ability to have that open hand with the other hand looking like it's pulling the glove off, so that's pretty awesome. Another vintage we had was the Gwen Stacy from the Spider Man vintage wave, and it also gave us the Mary Jane head. from the Venom Pool Builder Figure Wave. We had the Ghost Spider, or the Gwenom figure. Comes with the torso and the swords for the Venom Pool. Love that tongue that comes out of the max. The thing's awesome. From the Stiltman Builder build Figure Wave, which I'm only putting on here because some people did get it this year, but this is not really a 2020 release, it's a 2021 release. We had the Gwen Stacy from the Into the Spider Wars wave. She comes with the Spider Hand figure, open mask, closed mask. Also comes with the torso from the Stiltman Villa figure. From the First in Game Reverse Wave, we got the Miss Marvel figure with the Abomination Torso. Amazon exclusive, you had the Nimrod, Psylocke, and Phantom X 3 pack. And your back of your artwork. Here is your Psylocke figure. And all three. As a fan vote for 2020, we had Silk win. So here is the repaint of Silk. 
another vintage we got, which is actually another one of the 2021 figures. I'm just throwing on this list so you guys can see it, but it's not a true 2020 release. Was the vintage black cat from the Marvel Unknown description? You had the cosplay Miss Marvel figure. There she is in her plastic, showing her in the comic book there as a team up with Spidey. Amazon exclusive, we had a Children of Thanos five pack. So we're gonna we got the Proxima Midnight re-release repaint. So here are all of the females for 2020 loose. And here they all are in package. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up. Check out my other Every Marvel Legends videos. Also some top 10 lists that I have. And I will talk to you guys later. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest find all the photos that you want of these videos.